Right, yo boys, welcome back to another video. If you guys haven't seen, yeah, they've released the new 85. What was it? Special card? Hector Bellerin? Look at this. Let me go let me go get his stats up. Yeah, he's so good. He's easy to do, his objectives is perfect. It's the first thing they have released in ages on FIFA, yeah. Like the first thing they've released in pure ages, which is actually good. Like, instead, we were expecting Icon SBCs, and they said they gave us this, and we could not be happier, man. Could not be happier. It's pretty easy to do as well, and you have to do in a specific game mode, which, I mean, people complain about, but I think it's all right, yeah? I think it's all right. I mean, so this, this is what you need to go through, yeah? So first of all, I'm going to build my team, show you what I'm using, because you have to have specific, like, requirements, yeah? And then once we do that, yeah, I'll go through each of the steps and how you guys can do it for, like, simple. Like, simple. Right, so boys, I will go show you my team and I'll be back in a second. Right, boys, so this is my team I have done for the objective. So the ratings are you need a 77 rated team overall. Yeah, and you're not allowed to have any bronzes to lower the rating. And you're not you're only allowed three silvers. So this is the team I built. The, the reserves don't mean anything. I tried to sneak Neymar on the bench. Yeah, I tried to sneak Neymar on the bench, but it didn't work. So this is my team. Yeah, Kante and Allen, hopefully they're going to carry, man. I hope they're going to carry. And Ketty over Hunter. I mean, this in Ketty card is all right. He's got good finishing. For a silver, this finishing is great. Oli Watkins, good card. I mean, Tamora is going to be perfect for this, yeah? He's a low-rated, insane card. Adama, we all know about Adama. Yeah, we've got Fredericks. You guys all know about Fredericks. He's just got pace. He's got an all right card. So this is my team, yeah? So I would suggest building something around like this. I put three silvers in your starting lineup because it lowers your rating even more. And I'll just put your main players from your main team into it instead of investing, going out your way to buy it. But boys, we're going to go through each what you need, yeah, and how you can do it for really quickly. And I'll be back then. Right, boys, so these are the conditions that you need to do to get this Hector Bellerin. So it's an 85 raid card. I would probably say it's the best right back in the game. We'll go look at his stats later in the video, yeah. But I think he's probably the best right back in the game, apart from, uh, like, Kafita. I think Kafita's probably better. But, um, yeah, so you need to get... F we need to win 15 matches using only Premier League players... In the fuck friendly. Yeah, so that's probably the one which will take you the most. The scoring prowess, this is easy. Just 30 goals using Premier League players. They're all Premier League players. You need to score 30 goals. Assists, 20 assists using Premier League players. That's easy enough because you've all got uh, Premier League players in your squad. So you just need to get 20 assists. Uh, the, Premier League, the Premier range is probably the hardest one. You need to assist four times in four separate matches across of a Premier League player. So, I mean, this is probably going to be the hardest one. So, you might have to get someone like Calvert-Lewin, Harry Kane, or someone like that, just so you can cross into him. You need, like, a target man. And then the finesse shot, just score a finesse shot, six separate matches. That is easy enough, yeah? And all of this will get you that amazing Hector Bellerin card. And we'll go check out his stats in a second. I'll right. see you there. Boys, this is Hector Bellerin's card. He's got three-star skill moves, two-star weak foot. He's got high-low work rates. I think that could be a problem, yeah? That could be a problem, but if you tell him to stay back, I think he'll be fine. Um, his biggest problem with his card has to be probably his strength. Everything else is good, but, I mean, just look at that card. He has to be, yeah? He has to be the best right-back in the game, apart from the icon right-back from Brazil. What's his name? Like, Capita or something? Like, I think, I think this objective is perfectly worth it. I genuinely think he's probably the best right back in the game. And I suggest you guys do him, yeah? And in this video, I'll show you how to do it for, like, as quick as you can, pretty much. I would personally stick either an anchor. Yeah, pro I'll probably stick an anchor on him. Or maybe a sentinel. It depends how quick he feels in game. Because sometimes people feel like, um... Some people... Sometimes people feel slower in games and they say, Yeah, oh, no, the anchor. It's got to be an anchor. Oh, look at that card. Oh, my. Look at that card. Bro, I can't wait to get my hands in it. So, yeah, this is his stats. He's got great pace. Shooting doesn't matter. Passing, he's got good crossing, good short pass. Pretty much all you need. I mean, it would be better to have, like, you know, better stats there. But, I mean, you don't really need it. Um, Dribbling. I mean, his dribbling's insane apart from his composure. But that's not a problem. I mean, that dribbling is so well-rounded. Defender with an anchor, bro. His defending's amazing. 94 stand, 95 slide. That's amazing. And then physicalities with an anchor, 83 jumping, 85 stam, 76 strength, 87 crunch. That's perfect, bro. That's perfect. Like, I'd probably say, I, I remember when this came out to my chat, yeah, and we're currently streaming on Twitch right now. Link in description. Be sure you go check that out. When I was talking to my chat about this year, I was like, they, they better have upped his stamina because they did him so dirty last year with the stamina. So the fact they've upped stamina to A5 is perfect. So, boys, that is what the card looks like. And we're now going to get into how you can do it for really quick. He's on my high for me completing Hector Bellerin. As you'll probably see, it was really easy. And if you guys don't know, 
your friendlies is based off your division rival division. So I'm in Div 1, it's and I'm in, I was completely destroyed by Look at that. Ollie Watkins, crossbar, and water guard. The so I'm going to go through a couple of USA. tips and tricks. They so first of all, to get the crosses, yeah? For some easily. of you, that might be the hardest. For some of you, it might be the easiest. Depends so on how you play. I mean, I usually don't cross, but the only crossing I do usually do is R1. That's because it's overpowered. And yet again, you can use it in this situation. R1 crossing is so good. You'll see it a couple of times in these the highlights. But if you just get to the byline minutes. with a quick player, St. Maximin, Adama, well, and you R1 here. cross it, they'll, they'll whip it as hard Must as they can with a bit of whip, and they'll go across and around the defenders. The defenders will miss it, and you'll have an easy volley into the net. That's how you get the easy four crosses. And the next one for the goals, yeah, I don't, you don't have to worry about goals. Once you win 15 games, you will score. But there, that's an example of the R1 crossing. It's just easy. I mean, even Allen's scoring. At this point, it's just too easy to score those crosses. I, I think EA need to patch that. So I think it's too hard to power. But, I mean, for this moment, to get the Hector Beller in, I mean, I think it's perfect. Oh, this is a great cross saying that's a little chip there. But, I mean, first of all, I want to say, this Hector Bellerin card is genuinely amazing. Like, I think Inside it's the one of the best things he has put in, in the whole game. He's the best right back Delightful in the game, pass. apart from uh, Capita, the uh, Brazilian icon. Apart from him, he's the best uh, right back in the game. I would suggest you guys are doing him, Adama. even if he doesn't fit in your team. Oh, Eight nice chemistry with pass. an anchor. This is post card And I've used him. He's so good. Look at that finish from Niketia. Easy. That was a finesse shot as well. But, boys, I use my 4-4-2 tactic. You'll probably see my video, like, up there. Or there, I don't know where I put it, and uh, they'll be the tactics I used in this video. They're the tactics I use in the weekend league, and I got gold two, so uh, gold one. Sorry, I got 20 wins. And because this is postcom, I stuck Hector Berrin in my team about 10 wins in, and he carried me. He was so good, genuinely, he's amazing. But uh, I would probably say the best player in that team had to be Eddie Naketia. Out of all the players, for a silver card, his finishing is genuinely in the same. And once you get to uh, once you get to all the, all the, the other uh, objectives being right, complete, you'll get to a point pitch, where you've got all the crosses done, all the goals player. done, all the assists done, but you only need the wins. And that's probably when it gets the hardest. Because when you're playing just for wins, you start not playing for fun. Which is why I suggest what I did is I took out my Golo Kante. And I replace him with Gedson Fernandez, the top player. This. First of all, he's got a great card, so I great with. But I replace him, there you go, another top player. Oh, it's just too overpowered. I replace Kante with Gedson Fernandez. And then what I did is I subbed on Neymar. And because I don't need any Prem related people, I just subbed Neymar and I just obliterated people. You don't see it in this clip because this is from my first like five or six games. But what I ended up getting eight or nine rage quits. Genuinely, it, this is one of the most fun things I've done. And this guy, many teams look like this. They had low rated meta players. Tomori is a mate. That Twan Zabi on my team, he was genuinely and a warm amazing. On what is but a word to just as well, another tip. When you get penalties, my name yeah, is Derek Ray, or not even when you get penalties, you try and win penalties if you're struggling Arsenal to get the finesse shot. Fullback, what you can do is when you're taking a pen penalty, make sure you give it to a Premier League player contest. and then let the uh, Premier what, League Lee, player finesse it. You'll see a damn here. Thanks, I think Great Adama does a bit of dribbling, here. if I remember rightly. Look at that. Sure bit of left stick dribbling. Two star weak foot to Nketiah. Easy goal. Genuinely, some of these is. plays the I did were amazing. I genuinely was having some mad fun. Some but in my team, I made a couple of tweaks and changes for when you last saw it. So, um, instead of Bernard, I, I brought on St. Maximin, as you guys could see. Mainly because of my, I was speaking to my chat. I stream on Twitch four times a week. Go check it out. I was speaking to my chat and they were like, I mean, if you're going to stick Bernard in, who's 78 rated, danger. why don't you go stick Using in St. Maximin, who's 80 rated, and he's a much better card. And I was like, yeah, that sounds great. And this is the uh, penalty as well. So, Alan wins the penalty. What I do is I give it to Eddie Nketiah, and then he just finesses it, bottom bins. Well, that and that's about it. Rebuke, You'll see it. Genuinely, that this is a, a good uh, penalty right, technique for if you're in champs as well. No, Starting in a different direction, because they can see your head movement and then changing it. So, I look at where I want to go. Look at the other side, put it in the middle, and then just change it there. Easy. And, and that the comes to finesse shot, which is great, because if you guys struggle to score finesse shot, which has probably got to be one of the hardest, because unless you're smacking someone and you're beating them by a huge amount, to try and force yourself to change your game style, change your game plan and score finesse shots is pretty difficult. So doing it on penalties, when you sway the ball, try and finesse it from a tap in. That's another easy way of doing it. And yeah, but boys, that is going to be it for the highlights. I will see you claiming the Hector Hello, everyone, and welcome. And we me, like some of my highlights and all that of me playing. Um, we have ended with another rage quit. It was really easy, and this should be Hector Bellerin done. Look at that, eleven minute rage quit, easy. You'll see from the um, you'll see from all the clips that it was really easy to do it. I, I mean, I must have got six, seven, eight rage quits. It was quite easy, and the goals, the assists, the co uh, crosses, it was all easy. So let's go uh, claim this Hector Bellerin. Hopefully, he should be there.
Please be there. If he isn't there, there you go. Right. This should be him all done. There you go. Right. This is Hector Bellerin complete. The six finesses, the four crosses, the 20 assists and the 30 goals to Premier League players. And now the 15th Premier League win. Let's go claim that. What are we saying? Right. Two red gold player pack. Oh, yeah. You would have seen the packs as well. I didn't pack anyone good. Right. Let's go claim this Hector Bellerin. Oh, it's such a good card, man. I can't wait to put him in my squad. Um, It's currently midway through the weekend league. So I still have the rest of the week in league. Does he not walk out? That's it. Right, boys, that is the card. High, low, 510. Three star skills. Two star weak was a bit like naff, but like, I mean, it doesn't really matter. He's a right back. Oh, that's such a good card. And for free, I mean, that must have taken me about three hours in total to do. So I genuinely suggest you guys doing it. Right, let's go send him to club. I'm going to go through my team, yeah? I made a few uh, little tweaks and changes from when, um, from when uh, I showed you guys my team at the beginning. Uh, so this is why I ended up playing with. I got rid of Kante for the end. For when I needed just the wins, I got rid of Kante. And then put Neymar on as well, like my super sub. But yeah, this is the team I ended up rocking with. Bro, this Eddie Nketiah, you can't see stats because he was in friendlies, yeah. But he was so good. His passing shit, but apart from that, everything else was good. Obviously, Neymar carried. Tomori and Twan Zabel were so good at the back. Fredericks, he was great. Saint and, and Dama didn't really do anything. Kante was amazing when I played with him and then I took him off. But yeah, this is the team I use. Let's go open this two red gold player pack and that'll be the end of the video. Alright, come on. Give us someone good. Give us someone good. Two red gold player pack. Come on, just give us a walkout. Give, give us a, a good player back for completing this objective. It's obviously rare. It's not a walkout. It's not boars. Right, boys, on that note, I'm going to be ending the video. Hopefully, this video was uh, useful and you guys could take notes from it. And yeah, so boys, be sure to like, comment, subscribe and turn the notification bell on. All my links are down below, my Instagram, my Twitter, everything. I respond to all of them. Yeah, and especially my Twitch. We stream four times a week on Twitch. Go check that out. It's a lot of fun. The support's been mad recently. And yeah, so boys, I will see you in the next video. And peace. Easy two-minute video.